thankfully, a Sanditon episode full of Charlotte and Colborne. We've been waiting for an episode like this since the beginning of season three, and we finally got it. Before episode five, Charlotte and Alexander could be together briefly and mainly in other people's presence. But this time, they were alone, free from interference, and we knew their time together would change something in both of them, and it did. Charlotte finally found the courage to break things off with Ralph. Let's analyze in detail how that came to be. The episode began with Charlotte leaving with Alexander to find Augusta and Edward. Before that, Alexander learned from Leo that Augusta and Edward planned to go somewhere called Falmouth. So, with an all-night trip, Charlotte and Alexander went there trying to find at which in Augusta and Edward could be staying. Of course, during this journey, they had much time to talk. Alexander was angry at himself, thinking he could have stopped Augusta from running away because she could not think independently. But Charlotte refused that sentiment, saying that often it's a father or a brother who thinks on a girl's behalf, but girls don't require saving from themselves. It doesn't matter if it was Edward. Augusta was in love and wanted to be with him. Alexander should not force her to be in a loveless marriage with someone else. We knew that Charlotte had an incredible influence on Alexander, but we didn't expect it to be this much. When they found Augusta and Edward, Alexander was ready to let Augusta decide on her own. He said, if Augusta believed Edward was right for her, he would not stand in their way. One journey with Charlotte, and the man turns into a feminist. We were genuinely moved by how much he respects Charlotte and her opinions. He was ready to let Edward into the family if it was Augusta's choice. But that's not what happened. Edward weirdly came to his senses and made a bizarre confession. He said he only wanted Augusta for her inheritance. As Augusta tried not to believe that, he turned even more cruel. Did she think that it would be her who would redeem Edward Denham? Yes, we watched that scene with great amazement. For once, in the three seasons of Sanditon, Edward Denham did something right. For the first time in his life, he thought about someone other than himself. It turns out he deeply cared for Augusta. Otherwise, why would he confess everything when he was this close to marrying her? When he returned to Sanditon and talked to Lady Denham, we could see that he was genuinely upset. He did this because he believed Augusta deserved someone better, someone with a better reputation and a better name. Well, there is a first time for everything. We believed Edward couldn't change, but this episode made us rethink our perspective on him. He may have some goodness in his heart after all. Augusta was heartbroken, but this journey helped Charlotte and Alexander immensely. When Alexander talked to Augusta, having arrived at the inn, he mentioned how remarkable a young woman she was and asked if she believed Edward was worthy of her. Here, we thought he was actually talking to Charlotte. He questioned how Charlotte would think Ralph would be the right choice for her. But he also understood that Charlotte was with Ralph because of her parents' decision, not because she was in love with the man. However, Charlotte also understood that life was too short to be stuck in a loveless marriage. Especially when she saw how Tom was crying over Mary in her sickbed, she realized that she should be with the person she loves. At the end of the episode, she had a conversation with Ralph. At first, we thought Ralph would initiate the breakup, but it turned out to be Charlotte. Nevertheless, he finally understood that Charlotte was in love with Mr. Colborne and that she never chose to get married. Finally, she said she could not marry Ralph, even though Ralph was heartbroken to hear the news. It appears he loved her although this was an arranged marriage. We only hoped Charlotte did not drag him for so long, but at least it's over now. Next week in the show's final episode, perhaps we can finally see her getting a happy ending with Alexander. What did you think about Edward in this episode? What will happen to Charlotte and Alexander in the next episode? Let us know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like and share this video. Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you soon.